I'm Caleb Dennison, and welcome to DT Daily. On the big show today, Elon Musk's Hyperloop will get a test run, cloud storage on your wrist, and a drone that really gets around. Thank you very much. Remember how Tesla boss Elon Musk shook up the tech world a while back with his crazy Hyperloop super high-speed transport idea? Well, some people don't think it's crazy at all. Musk envisioned a Hyperloop trip between LA and San Francisco taking about 30 minutes, which is way faster than even jet travel. Now, plans are underway to build a five-mile-long Hyperloop test track in California, and the Hyperloop Transportation Technologies firm says they're going to get it built. HTT isn't a bunch of garage tinkerers either, with a bunch of brains from SpaceX, Airbus, Yahoo, and NASA all getting involved. They hope to start construction next year. Cloud storage is a thing these days, and even if you're unsure as to how it works, it's nice to know your stuff is backed up somewhere if you lose your phone or your hard drive crashes, right? Well, problem is, hackers hacking the cloud has some people worried, including these guys who have come up with a timepiece that functions as your own personal cloud. It's called Revault, and the device can be used as a watch, pocket watch, or pendant, and holds up to 128 gigs of your stuff, all available to several devices wirelessly, no internet required. Pretty slick, just don't lose the watch cloud thing itself. We're pretty big fans of drones here at DT, and it's always fun to see what the little guy can dream up to improve the breed. So how about this? A tracked tank-like vehicle that's also a quadcopter. Oh yeah. It's called the Be Unstoppable Flying Tank Drone. Cool name, check. And it's the work of this guy, and it looks like way too much fun. In tank mode, it pretty much dominates any obstacle. But if you do come across something it can't conquer, just take to the air. We love it. It's on Kickstarter right now, starting at about $90. But for $150, it also includes a live video feed ability and a few more tech tricks. It also looks cool. Check again. Now all we need to do is take this idea and scale it up, because rush hour traffic might actually turn out to be fun. That's DT Daily for today. We'll be back tomorrow.